Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Uh, today I wanted to talk about the Reds and some of the bold moves that they have made over the past few days. As everybody knows, the Reds have, uh, they got off to a terrible start and have kind of followed it up with, you know, basically 500 play. Well, uh, following Friday's uh, blown 8-0 lead um, to the Giants, the one in which they lost 12-11 to in extras, uh, they've really you know, taken some pretty strong action over the past few days. Uh, gone now is Matt Kemp. Uh, he was outright released yesterday. And this is a move that, um, first off, I never really thought that he was going to be there the whole season, if I'm being honest. And they actually thought that they might have even traded him before the season. But this is a move to basically ensure that Sinzel will be an everyday outfielder. And uh, unfortunately, they're going to have to eat Kemp's contract. But he didn't really seem like a good fit. And if I'm being honest, um, I don't really know how much he even wanted to be in Cincinnati. Uh, people, you know, they make a big deal about what he said during the Pirates game about, you know, quote, I don't know, I just work here, man. But uh, this is a guy who played in back-to-back -back World Series, and I, I can't imagine playing in small market Cincinnati was very ideal or exciting for him. And, you know, he's an older player too, so I'm not too sad to see him go. And, you know, I'm more excited to see Sinzel up, and he's basically... The outfield uh, job is his now in center field, so that's great news. And speaking of Sinzel, it was really cool to see him hit his uh, first big league home run yesterday, so uh, good for him. The other move they made was calling up Josh Van Meter from Triple A Louisville. Uh, Van Meter's been tearing it up down there with 13 home runs. And uh, one of the reasons why I like this move is because uh, the Reds, it's showing that they're being proactive, which I like. Uh, typically, you know, I feel like in the past, maybe they've caught up guys, you know, late in the season when it's already shot. So it's really nice to see. Um, and I'm excited. So now uh, the four man outfield before the season uh, of Puig, Kemp, Shubler, and um, who am I forgetting? And Winker is now uh, Shubler's in Triple A and Kemp is going. So they're making changes. They're trying to um, they're trying to do their best to you know be competitive and be relevant. And as a fan, I can respect that. So I'm excited to see these new guys going forward. So in with the old, out in with the new, out with the old. So anyway, I just want to give some of my thoughts about the recent moves. Thank you guys for watching. I'll talk to you later. Take care. Bye.